Hello and welcome to Source Sounds video here with a 2015 BMW M4. What we've done in this vehicle is we've done an audio upgrade to quite a high spec. I'll show you around the vehicle now. Okay, so now this is inside the vehicle. One of the customer's requirements is obviously he didn't want to see anything. So all the products have been installed behind the factory location. So behind there is the Audison Voce tweeter. Then we have the Audison Voce mid behind the factory grill in the door. And then underneath the driver and passenger seats are the upgraded woofers, which were fitted the rainbow woofers in there. Now on the stereo itself, you can see here, this is the factory system. What we've done is we've tied into that very cleverly using the Audison processor. And everything in this vehicle is totally, totally discreet. So you can't see any products at all which is exactly what the customer wanted. Okay, so we're now at the rear of the vehicle. I'll show you inside the boot now. Right, so in the boot here, what we've got is a Xfire XFR 12 inch subwoofer. The customer wanted a sub which would handle quite a lot of power. I'm also now gonna show you where the processor is mounted. Now underneath that panel there, which is a factory panel, we've actually added the Audison bit processor and then there's amplifiers underneath the boot floor. I'll show you that build now. Okay, so this is the boot floor. I've now taken the subwoofer out. What we've done is we've remade the boot floor. We made a panel to be able to house the two Audison Voce amplifiers. Now in here, what we've actually done is we've mounted the two amplifiers and we've stacked these, but built a very clever cooling system. So what we've got is there are two fans inside the boot one is circulating air across one of the fans, the other, the amplifier, is actually stacked underneath with another amp circulating. And then what we've done is, underneath the boot floor, because it's been made of ply, so it's quite strong, but then we've actually got some grill there, which allows air to come out of the boot on top of there. Okay, so now what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be an audio setup. Now what this entails is basically using a PC with some software and what this will allow us to do is be able to tweak the sound because on the factory iDrive system this has very little control other than a bass and treble adjustment which really doesn't allow us to get the sound that they want plus this also allows us to make changes because the factory BMW audio unfortunately does some really weird things to make the factory speakers sound good but we can correct this with our processing so I'm going to show you in the boot now we've got the laptop hooked up this allows me to make some changes. So here's the PC software. And what this allows me to do is basically make changes to be able to adjust pretty much every parameter on the sound system. Now what I can do here is obviously make adjustments to the equalization curve. I can make adjustments to the time alignment. I can make adjustments to the crossover features. Right, we're inside the vehicle now. Now one of the things that often a lot of our BMW drivers complain about is that the system itself, the clarity, is just very, very poor. Plus also there's no dynamic control. So there's no real output and no kind of volume really out of the factory audio system. What I'm going to try and show you now, which is quite awkward in a video, is what we managed to be able to achieve with the dynamics of what we've put into this vehicle. So I'll quickly show you now. going to get quite loud. I think you'll agree there that the output is considerably more 
than the factory audio with the quality. Again, for further information on upgrading your BMW, give us a call at Source Sounds on 0114 257 1550. Thank you for watching this video.